Yes, just a little bit of walking. Because it's all whole body movement, you know? And you know, the walking feet position, uh, not too narrow, it's a broad stand, not too long, you know? Your heel should be in the height of your other foot's uh, toes, you know? Broad. Uh, one, two, uh, if you like, two foot lengths apart, if you like to. Uh, that you are able to feel the rotation of your hip while distributing the weight, you know? To the sides, yes. Always beginning in the right leg, standing in my right leg. And it's a very fast um, yoga asana, you know? Relax, yes, this time from the top to your feet that you are able to bring your weight points, really weight points, in alignment, you know? And that's the most relaxing way to stand around, you know, lower hip to the front, slightly uh, to the front with your collarbone, you know? Take out the tension of your knee, you know? The hip position, shoulder position, yes. And then, without weight, this step, feel the ground. No, there's no need to rush, feel the ground. If it's stable, something to take care of, well, it's okay, you know, then Rotating the hip while distributing your weight. Yes. And the front foot is aiming towards your walking direction. You now coming back with your weight to the right leg so that you are able to open a little bit your left leg to the side, to the left side, a little bit tilted. 5, 10 degrees, something like that. And then distributing the weight, feeling comfortable, and let your right leg come by itself to the heel up, narrow stand, first position for this basic walking. And then perform along, just a little bit, And this weight distribution is really to, uh, to rotate your leg, your knee, your leg with your knee without weight. You know, that's really important that you are never rotating your leg with weight because that's not what your knee is meant to perform, you know. It can rotate a little bit, but that's not good for your, what's that, pellets? You know, for your joint. Yeah, that's already nice. Getting loose, comfortable. And then rotating, yes. And then coming to carrying the chi. You know, that's, that's a nice loop to perform. You can stay with it. 10, 20, two hours, if you like. And 
synchronize with your breathing cycle, you know. In, breathing out, breathing in, and so forth, if you like to. Most important is coming down with your awareness, coming down with your weight point, being aware, you know. Develop your inner smile and feeling comfortable with this carrying the chi. Now for me that's already enough, but I have to perform it. You know, even if I like to perform basic walking backwards, which we will perform now. But you know it's good a good choreography to to get into the flow if you like you know? walking backwards with the monkey you know? slow and feel your foot sole of your foot Like the last ninja. And also the hip is rotating, you know. When you are in your front leg, your hip is directed to the front leg's foot position. You know, when you are coming back with your weight, your hip is rotating and rotated in towards the direction of your new standing legs foot it's always too much to explain to talk it's better to see your master and perform along that's already enough and now a little bit repulse monkey playing with the monkey That's also a nice loop, you know? If you are without any restriction in the camera view, you can run around in a circle in a loop. That's enough. Enough Tai Chi for me. Of course you have to perform all these forms at least five minutes, I think. You know? And uh, if you are performing it, if you are feeling that you are getting loose, relaxed, and your inner smile is evolving, then you are really on the good, on the right path, you know. And then um, you can feel it also when your demand for something new is de decaying. I think that's the right word. You know, so, so that you are content with this form which you are performing you know? content with the weather if it's sunny if it's rainy if it's hot if it's cold you know? of course if you are in the sun and it's getting too hot go into the shadow you know it's not without any wisdom <laughs> yeah? that's not a stupid smile of course a stupid smile might be helpful sometimes. Mm -hmm.